no easy task. Even when you hated him the most, you were obsessed with being just like him. Convinced that that included his grudges. Sometimes I think you forget that half of you is me. You're your own man, John Ross. Your decisions are your own. Our first guest this morning, Linda Gray, continues to win our hearts on the TV show Dallas as we tune in to see if Sue Ellen will hold her ground. How could you not be charmed by her strong yet vulnerable Texas character? And Linda is here today to share one of her favorite recipes and talk a little bit more about some of your JR memories. Oh, yes. Yeah. Okay, so what are we making today? We are making Moroccan red lentil soup. And you're a soup lover. I'm a soup lover. Yes. And do you want to know why I, I make this soup? Tell me. Okay, I knew you'd ask. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I make this because the hours on our show are very sporadic. Right. There's never two days that are the same. And so when I come home late at night, I don't want to make a big meal and I don't want right. to do all that, but I want something healthy. Right. So what I do is I make a big pot of it. And when it's cool, I put it into individual, like one serving, one bowl for sure. not me, into a Ziploc bag. And I put them in the freezer, like stack them up like so pancakes. Smart. Uh -huh. So in the morning, whatever, probably 4.30 in the morning, I take one bag out, I put it in the sink to defrost. Uh -huh. When I come home at night, it's I make a quick little salad, heat up my bowl of soup, and I have dinner. That is so smart, because it it's is very so hard smart. to eat very healthy smart. when you're oh. when your schedule is nutty like that. It's crazy, yes. and then they have that wonderful uh, crab services crab everywhere. Crab services, <laughs> yeah, that you have, oh, I'll just have one cookie, or right. I'll have one of these, and that, that's like wrong. So right. I don't do that. So Sue Ellen is very smart, as we know. I love and, it, yes, uh, she so, is. So she cooks. And um, you know, this is what this is what we do. So, what do we have going on in here? Okay, we've got um, we're doing a little olive oil, and we have uh, carrots and onions and parsley and cilantro because it kicks it. And then we just did a little olive oil there, a little right. bit of salt, and right. then this kind of cooks up for about okay. eight minutes. Oh, okay, good. And it smells fantastic. It doesn't it smell it Smells good? amazing. You can't. I can't have something bland. Right. I mean, if you work all day, you want something with some flavor. flavor. Yeah. It has to have flavor, so it can't be boring and it can't be, you know, diet food and all that. For it has sure. zero no food. But this is healthy. Everything's. I like to do organic if we can. Yes. That's the best. Yes. And uh, if we can't, uh, we do the best. Thing we can. Now you're living in Dallas. While I'm you living shoot in this Dallas. And so I love great. it here. I love it here. Because with the original show, you spent most of the time in Los Angeles shooting. Yes. Is that right? Yes. But now it's a lot of it is here. So you, do you have a good kitchen you can cook we this all, kind of thing in? We all moved here. I so love it. I had to have a kitchen. Larry stayed in a hotel. I said, I can't stay in a hotel. There's no kitchen. And I have a cat. Yes. So cats are not going to stay in a hotel. And I need it's, a kitchen. It is hard to find a cat, a, a hotel cat that will take a cat. A cat. <laughs> so uh, cat's in the condo, loving it. He's now right. a condo cat. And um, I cook. It's great. And we all, most of us are do our own cooking. I love that. Because we don't have, we have weird hours. And yes. Is this how you keep your figure so fabulous? Hey, figure say, you know, we have to work on it. We have to work we on do. it. We do. We do that in your gratitude walks you were telling gratitude us about walks. So on walk the broadcast. And we, we eat properly. I yeah. love it. Okay, so what do we do? We've got everything kind of everything is browning. Like do you browning. wait till it gets brown or no? I do it like eight minutes. I okay. just I just kind of check it out. I'm kind of one of those uh, a little bit of that, like a little, that yeah. kind of a cook, you it's know. Good. And, and then what's our first thing that we add? Okay, now we're gonna add some garlic. Gar we get some garlic. And we got ginger. See, this is gonna Yum. kick it all yeah. up. It would just kick it right up here. And then, let's see, we've got our ginger. Then we got turmeric, which I love. This is fantastic. I think that's what I can smell. Is that you what can I smell, smell right it. now? Yeah. Yes, it smells really and good. Turmeric, and then this is, so that's when it gets all this good stuff. And some cinnamon. And that's what kind of gives it that Moroccan yes, flavor, like, right? This is yes. yum. What is fantastic. this stuff? Doing? So that, see, you can smell it now. It smells Don't you great. like that smell? Mm-hmm. Okay. And, and it looks pretty, too. And then we have red lentils. I love lentils. Do you like lentils? I love them. And I don't eat a lot of meat. So the lentils yeah, have all either. the protein. Yes, yeah. it's great. And I that's love what them. we do. I'm so glad that you do. So yeah. this is. So we mush this stuff around all like this, and then we do Hungarian paprika. Oh, Why I've Hungarian? Heard of this. Because yeah. it's a little sweeter than oh. uh, normal, regular. normal regular paprika. Oh, okay. So that and goes in. I guess you could just get it anywhere, huh? Yes, you Hungarian? can. Hungarian. Okay. And you just ask for sweet. If you, if they don't, it doesn't say Hungarian. You just get sweet paprika. Sweet paprika. Like okay. that. And then we add some diced. Um, 
tomatoes. Yum. Yum. Can you leave all the we juice like, there? Yeah, all yeah. of it. Just put it in there. And if you want to, you know, uh, put it in a food processor and grill it. But I don't. I don't have time for all that. Do you buy the canned? I buy the canned. Yeah, why not? Yeah. And you can get it at organic stores too, right? Yeah. yeah. So I do all that. Mush it that up. And then we have about... You look like you're getting a workout there, trying to get it all stirred <laughs> in, too. I got one arm that's good. <laughs> really good bicep on one. And then we got 12 cups. I know it sounds like a lot, but this is organic vegetable broth. So okay. I try not to, um, I don't know, I'm just like trying to get off meat and yes. stuff like that. So I'm trying to get, this will take forever. Anyway, it's 12 cups of this stuff. <laughs> you know, that'll take a long time to do that. So Here, let me help you pour. You can help. You can squeeze this thing. Okay, I'll squeeze this one. And I'll open one. this one. And we'll do, see, we have to do this. Because I have no teamwork. Nobody has it. Women don't have time. No, it's true. And a lot of my male friends cook. They don't have time either. They say, "What? Well, this is takes it's too true. long." This could you do this in a crock pot? You you could. You have absolutely. a lot of people to feed or something. Yes, you absolutely. Could. Are we doing all of this? We're doing all of okay, it. It's about right. four cups. Okay. I don't really measure anything. <laughs> obviously, <laughs> obviously, it's like, oh, that sounds like twelve That's cups. That's okay. You could buy high, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's soup, I so like that. You, know, you put it in, but it smells yummy. It and, does. And that's the it word I have amazing. to have it. I have to have yummy. Yes. Uh, because otherwise, it, why, why bother? It I looks, throw in a little pepper and a little salt. So, mm. It looks like we have one going over here. You do. You do. And, oh my gosh, this, oh my gosh, look at that. Can y'all see that? Isn't that good? Yes. Isn't that yummy? <gasps> oh, and it and smells tasty? so good. Yes. <laughs> oh, it smells and great. And I take it to work. I'll take like one of those baggies to work and um, that's uh, the guys brilliant. at the, so I don't have to eat um, food, you know, that isn't what I want. Can I can I give it a little taste? I want you to. I okay. hope it's hot enough. It's been there for a oh, little while. Oh, that's okay. Then I don't but have to worry about it being hot. Yes. Mmm. Does it have good flavor? Are you happy? Oh my gosh, it's great. Okay. Mm -hmm. I know if she would lie. What did you put in? No, I wouldn't. <laughs> I've told the truth on the air before. <laughs> <laughs> um, it looks like. <laughs> It looks like it has maybe a lemon. Yeah, we peel. put a little lemon on the top. That's a little and perfect. a little garnish. Yes. Oh my gosh! But it's, it, everything it's kicks it. It goes to another level, and that's what I like. Right. I don't, I'm just boring. But you make this for yourself. <clears throat> you could serve this if you were having a dinner oh, party I do. or something. I do. Yeah, it's fantastic. Yeah. My kids love it. And, yeah. Um, so that's what I like. That's Thank one of my you. favorites. What a treat! Thank you so much. Thank I you. never thought I'd get to cook with you. This is <laughs> such a pleasure. Thank you.